Fisher, that executive, he probably has the daily access algorithm for the displaced central servers stored on his laptop. Lambert gave me pretty strict non-lethal parameters. If you stay close, you should be able to hack into his laptop wirelessly. I'll give it a whirl. Sam, each of Displace's different divisions seem to have their own server farm. I've put a program on your OPSAT that will build a little backdoor into their networks. You want me to upload that to each division server? I would appreciate it. Since you asked so nice. Good work, Sam. That's the first of their servers. If you can upload that to each of the other ones, I'll be able to snoop around as much as I please. I'll see what I can do. Let me just get these windows before we go. some of those at City Hall. Email me and remind me. I'll set you up with a good deal. Whoa. That was weird. Yeah. I've heard of this. It's called an electrochromic window. A small electric charge can change the opacity of microscopic crystals embedded in the glass. Cool. I'm thinking that your OCP should be able to toggle the state of the windows. I'm uploading the specification to your OPSAT. Thanks, Will. So, what did you want to show me? In the lobby of the Empire State Building, there are four brass rondelles, Art Deco pieces. Each rondelle represents one of the four disciplines of skyscraper construction. What, like engineering, financing, real estate? Machines, concrete, decoration, elevators. Elevators like this one here. Huh. Okay, Julian, what's your point? My point is that... Good work, Sam. Now you'll be able to access the central server on the first floor. This wireless stuff makes life a lot easier. Yep. Welcome to the Wi-Fi era. Remember, you're saying that to a guy from the era of Hi-Fi. Hi-Fi? As in, like, high in fiber? <sighs> don't put me in adult undergarments yet, kid. Stairs are cheaper than elevators, Tom. Why don't we have stairs as the fourth discipline of skyscraper construction? No one is gonna take the stairs up 70 stories. And does anyone ever question how much an elevator costs? Of course not. Right. And I'll tell you why. Because the cost of an elevator isn't measured by what you get. Hmm. It's measured by Where what you get. This place is incredible. We've got an intruder. Good. I've been looking for some action. Be careful what you wish for. Come out from there and show yourself!
hard, Sam. Upload that program to the last server and you'll make me the happiest girl in the world. You're easy to please. Access is a girl's best friend. Someone moving around out there? Who? No, no, who? That's why I'm worried. isn't there anymore. He's out of town. What, so you're just watching his stuff? <laughs> yeah. Emptying his liquor cabinet and playing video games. He's got the new Prince of Persia. Yeah? I heard it's awesome. Gonna be game of the year, man. Can't wait to play it. Thanks, Sam. That's the last one. I can't wait to sniff around and displace his laundry basket. Uh... What? Laundry. I totally forgot. Someone has shunted the data we need off the server. Log in name M. Nedich. Mylon Nedich? That name is coming up an awful lot, but we still don't have anything on him. Probably a pseudonym. I'll see if I can find out who he really is. In any case, we need to get access to his computer. His office should be on the upper floor somewhere. Uh, sorry to interrupt, but. I see it. Power's coming back on. I see it, Grim. You got company. You might want to. I see it.
been hearing some creepy stuff about Mylon. I'm not sure I trust that. I knew that he got drunk with some of the guys in his temple last month. Wandered out of the park. Zerkezi is out of town, so there won't be a VIP, just the property. Okay. Sounds like a breeze. Well, it hasn't gone perfectly smooth so far. You'll get the full VIP rate, and you'll be on duty as though there is a package on site. Okay. Got it. Good. You reported 1300 tomorrow. Okay. I'll be there. Good grab, Fisher. Mylon Nedich's real name? Jesus. Milos Nowak. Milos Nowak. Who is he? The Barber of Bosnia. Suspected war criminal from the Bosnian conflict. Allegedly scalped some of his prisoners. Wanted in The Hague? Yeah. Bet you dollars the dinars that he doesn't make it to trial. That's okay. I think my money's safer on the Nikkei. Italian. Yes, the Florentine silk. Andretti? Who's Andretti? Andretti? The famous designer. Men's suits, tuxedos. I'm not a tuxedo kind of guy. But, but you are some kind of spy. Yeah, I'm the real kind, not the tuxedo kind. I'm the kind of spy who gets blood all over your Andretti unless you give me information. Oh God, please don't ruin my suit. How about a door code? CEO's office, 2609. Hokkaido. Hokkaido? Isn't that basically the Alaska of Japan? Yeah. Looks like Mylon Nedich has secretly relocated Zerkezi there. Interesting. Now we definitely need to talk to Shetland. Will its State Department handle that mess? You're going to Hokkaido. We're sending a helicopter to evac you from the roof.
As happy as we are to be back online here in New York, our thoughts turn to our loved ones who are defending us on this beautiful 4th of July. We go now live to the Yellow Sea where sailors aboard the USS Clarence E. Walsh are celebrating. We have Seaman Anthony Palmiera from Brooklyn, New York. Tell us, Seaman Palmiera, how you'll be celebrating Independence Day. Well, the captain's gonna have a, a big barbecue on deck, and tonight we'll have our own fireworks. <laughs> Captain, all of our command systems crashed. Nothing's responding. Seaman Palmiera, can you tell us what's happening there? <laughs> Sit tight, Sam. I'll call you back. It's the Koreans, Mr. President. I recommend that we declare war immediately. If it was Korea, there would be 200,000 men coming over the DMZ right now. Maybe it was an accident. Maybe a, an exercise. A, a test launch gone wrong. That's impossible. The Koreans can't even detect the Walsh. Never mind track it on radar and sink.